Well, let's just start now. You want to start now? Absolutely. All right, so here's the thing. I went on Facebook the other night and I promised I would come to Manhattan. I promised I would bring my little camera. I promised I would try and go behind the scenes to figure out what was going on. And I promised I would try and locate somebody with some level of importance. I found Alan Mulally. Good to see you. Unbelievable. Uh, you know, the big cheese, the head honcho. You're here in Herald Square and what, what have you guys done? You put a like a forest here. So. Mike, look at this. We're in the middle of New York City and here we have the outdoors. Is this appropriate for the launch of the new Explorer? It's, it's, it, it's fine with me. You realize though, you know, trees, outdoors, soil, this kind of thing is available in many places all over the country. Uh, you chose to put it here where it normally is and how come? Well, well, first of all, everybody loves the outdoors. And New York City is so vibrant and so neat and they love to get outside and explore to explore. Oh, that's clever. I see, you see what he did? Explore. You see what he did deep down? Now, Can I you knew, imagine? I knew you were an engineer, but now you're talking like a marketer. That's very <laughs> clever. I think I'm talking about a real life person that loves to go outside now. Would it be okay to walk us Let's into this area well, to perhaps get close to the Explorer? So now you're thinking, Mike, that the Explorer is up this hill. I'm saying there's a hill and there's a camouflage box, and behind the box I'm thinking there might be this... Let's walk up there. Let's go. and walk up the hill. This is going to be spectacular. Okay, so, as you pointed out, and you know you are a member of the Ford family, and you that. and you have not seen the Explorer yet. I have. No, I told him. The only thing I saw was a little piece of a, uh, like a back bumper, a little, a little light. Look at that grill. Uh, that's a good looking grill. Like, you, look at the stance. Yeah, that's a good looking stance. This is the reinvention of one of the most popular American icons, the Ford Explorer. And look at the way that sits. Look at the aerodynamics. What's it wearing? What is that fancy outfit you have? Well, on? that's uh, what we call camouflage. And that's how we keep it kind of quiet. So you know, you don't see you, it until tomorrow. You've been teasing your loyal fans now for weeks, months, really. Can I approach it? You can probably even touch it. You let me touch it? I'm gonna leave to touch. Can I touch it through the camouflage? The camouflage, tell me which part I can touch. You can touch any part you want as long as you don't take off the camouflage. But uh, now, okay. are you ready then? No, I'm, I'm ready. Okay. I've prepared myself. Here, you okay. know what? I've turned my little camera on. Maybe you can film me. What do you say? You want to touch an Explorer? Okay, here we go. All right. Mike is moving up towards the Explorer. <laughs> oh, I touched it! I touched oh it. I did it. I did it fast. Okay. Don't look. I'm just going to take a peek. Yeah, yeah that's, <laughs> definitely, that's definitely an Explorer. Come, come with me. I, I don't, I mean, take a look. Mike, take a look over here. Look at the lines. I don't seven, see any lines. I seven, seven, what? seven passengers, Mike. Seven, seven passengers. Let me, I don't take a picture of you. Seven passengers, 30% improvement in fuel efficiency, uh -huh. 5,000 pound towing capability, I-4 engine. I'm being sold an Explorer by the CEO of Ford. Turbocharging, well, fuel filming. injection. Uh -huh. Okay, that what sounds good. Do we know how much? We don't talk price, do we? And tomorrow, all the pricing will be available online. You're still teasing. No. No, you're teasing. Tomorrow is going to come faster than you can imagine. I know you promised everybody, but can you wait till tomorrow? I can wait till tomorrow. I'll tell you what. I, I just want to... I'm here because you're here. I'm, I, I'm sure whatever's under here is going to blow me away, and I can't wait to see it. But I just want to thank you for the last four years being in business with your company. I mean, it's it's been great. Okay. And thank you for dinner, too, by the way. You should see what he just did to a chicken <laughs> over at a steakhouse. Not far. Okay, now, Mike, Please. since you brought that up, yeah. um, we are fighting for the soul of manufacturing in that's the United States. States. I believe that's, that's right. That is what you have had a vision for. These are wonderful jobs for creating America, and the Explorer is how we create that. So we have you here with us. It's absolutely fantastic. Being invisible. Look, you know what? I, I don't like. I don't want to turn the whole thing into. Next thing you know, we'll be hugging and everything else. But, <laughs> but honestly, thank you for all that you've done. There's so, a lot of people are so proud of, of this company, and uh, I'm, I'm proud to be a part of that. See, that was gushy there. I, get, a, I can't a, help it. I get gushy. Good. It was really good. Thanks a lot. Okay.